I guess it's me, Jackson, and I've been seeing a lot of people making light boxes recently, so I decided to make one myself. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to make your very own custom light box. So first, you're going to start to make a world, and then from here, you're going to go to Maker Lab. Then you're going to click this button that says Light Box Maker, and click Start. And say, click New Project. And you're going to upload your image. I'm going to do my logo, and then I'm going to remove background, I'm going to turn that on. I'm going to go go confirm. And then since there's only three colors, I'm going to make this three. Here's maybe more than three colors, but mine's only three. I'm going to click next, and then make sure it looks good. I'm going to click confirm. And then... From here, you can just kind of make sure you it looks how you want it to look. And then we're going to make it pretty big. So, I have the P1S, and then the biggest I can make it on the P1S is the width is 233 millimeters, 0.92. And then the height, the biggest I can make it is 229 millimeters, 0.59. I'm just going to scoot this into the corner. And now we're going to go to preview. And then I think it looks good. And then right now you can see how bright it shines. And if you want it to shine brighter, you're going to go to dimensions. And you're going to make the front thickness the thinnest it goes. And that's going to make the uh, light box a lot brighter. And then I'm going to make it as bright as I can, so I'm going to make it the thinnest, which is 0.6 millimeters. I'm going to go back to design. Then I'm going to add some holes. So we're going to go to holes. And I'm going to hang this up on the wall. So I'm going to add a key. We're just going to bring this in the middle up here. And if you're putting lights in it, I suggest to add a rectangle to put the lights. So the lights can come out of the light box. Just gonna add it there. And then I'm gonna go back to preview. And then on the back, you can see there's a hook to hang it on the wall. And this is where the wire is gonna come out. And then from here, I'm gonna go to exp export. And I have the P1S and I have a 0.4 nozzle. And if you if you want to add lights, you can either buy them from here. Or you can go to Amazon, and I just bought some for like 10 bucks, and I'm going to put the link to those in the description. So I already got the lights, I'm just going to go download, and then we're going to open up that file. And then once it opens, I'm going to, um, we're going to align this, and then we're going to slice it. And then as you can see, our perch tower isn't touching the object, so I'm going to go back to preview. And then make sure this one looks good. You can see there's the hook for the wall, and this is where the wires are going to come out of. And also, do not mess with any of these settings. The Bamboo Studio, like, presetted these, so don't mess with them. Just keep them the same. And then from here, we're going to slice this one. And we'll see you when it's done printing. <laughs> Please remember to like and subscribe to my channel. Bye. Jackson out.